It's a classic and it's been modded and it's come back to my house. I'm gonna open it next, don't go anywhere. Hey everybody, it's me, Scott Galaxy. I am here with another episode of The Lame Video Gamer with a big special package today. Now, many of you were uh, here last time when I opened up my original Intellivision. Uh, it, is, it was in great shape, it's in, it was in fantastic shape. I even hooked it up, it worked perfectly. Um, if I use something uh, other than an HDTV. So what I did was I had this sent out to a wonderful place up in Canada to have it AV modded so that I can hook it up to my HDTV and it looks fantastic. They sent me a video of it already, uh, of what it looks like. So I'm excited to open it up. So if you saw me open up the original, uh, when, it, when I got it in, when it was in its original shape, um, stick around because now I've had it modded and I'll show you what it looks like and uh, let you know how I did that, where I sent it, and then if you guys like it, you can do it yourselves. So uh, let's open it up, see what this thing looks like. What's really cool is they sent it back in the same box that I sent it to them, so all the packaging is actually the same. Um, let's take a look here. So here it is, nicely wrapped up. Thanks guys. I'm gonna wipe this down too. Of course, you can't ever be too careful. Looks like they actually did it themselves, which is great. Um, so here it is. Kind of see it on the side there already, but here's the system. Uh, and then, boom, there are your, uh, your video and uh, audio AV outs. So um, this is great, looks great. They did a great job. Doesn't look like anything really happened to this thing. That's awesome. So, um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get this hooked up I've already cleared off a spot for it here, and uh, we'll see what it looks like up on my HDTV, uh, this 65-inch uh, 3D TV Goliath, and um, hopefully it looks great. All right, guys, here we go. I've got it hooked up. I only have it through the composite at this point. I don't have it going through an HDMI converter yet, so um, just wanted to see if the composite works, and then uh, we'll take it from there. But this is the moment of truth. Um, I have not tested it yet, so here it comes. Don't laugh at that. Boom. Let me see if I can fix that picture. There you go. Mattel Electronics presents Astro Smash. How cool is that? So let's take a look. Let's play it a little bit. Make sure that this, uh... oh yeah, that looks nice. I should probably turn the volume up, but that's pretty cool. Well, there you go, guys. That is it. That is uh, my new modded in television. Very, very excited about it. Uh, it looks fantastic. I know my, my camera doesn't do it justice, but um, it is really, really well it looks really great. It looks really great. That's just composite, so I'm, I'm kind of excited to see what it looks like when I get this hooked up to an HDMI converter um, to see if that crisp, you know, gives it gives it a little bit more crisp of a look. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. But I'm just happy it works. Uh, this is very exciting. I'm gonna play some Intellivision, and if you guys want to know uh, how to do this, I have some details in the um, ab about what I did and, and where I got it excuse me, in the details below, so check that out. I do want to give a uh, shout out to Video Game Repairs up in Edmonton, Canada. I'm here in LA, so it cost me like $50 or something like that to ship it up to them. Uh, the price was somewhere around $90, I guess, to do the um, to do the mod, and then they sent it back that was all included. So, uh, you know, if you have $150, $50 or so laying around, uh, definitely send it to them. They did a great job. They were super fast too when they did it literally the day they got it and then uh, sent it back within 
I don't know, I've, I've only been without it for a couple of weeks. So um, highly recommend it. So if you guys have any questions, you know, feel free to uh, comment below. Uh, and uh, I'm going to go play some television. This is great. It's great. See you guys next time.